Hey there. Um, before we get to the little thing then, I'm just going to show you my dog. It's kind of really sad right now because he has severe heartworm, so we don't know if he'll last. Um, but he's adorable. His name is Lightfoot. Um, he was an abandoned dog, so yeah. We kind of just took him in. Hey, buddy. He's also really camera shy, but let's go. And here are my guineas, and then it looks like there's one chicken with them. Yeah, let's hold that steady. It's really shaky, but yeah. Super ugly birds, but they're hilarious and fun. <laughs> they're just sort of digging in there. Lame. Chicken. Let's scare them away. Hey there. Um, today we are going to be talking about influences. Um, basically any kind of influence. Um, we'll say friends, um, video games you play, um, whatever you watch, listen to, um, which you allow yourself to be, um, what's it called? We'll just say whatever you allow yourself to be around. Um, so, oh boy, that's dark. Um, but, um, basically it's kind of, uh, you have to be able to choose. Like, okay, so we all start out with our own um, personalities, um, our traits and everything, just who we are. But um, a lot of us can be changed through other stuff. I mean, come on, that's basically how everybody is except um so you can't just say you know oh that won't that won't mess with me if i do it because things definitely can't be so over the past few months um i've been like you know um looking around seeing what i have been doing um and uh, figuring out what is influencing me in the right and wrong ways um so, uh, let's see, we'll start out with, let's say, number one. The biggest one would be friends. Friends influence you so much, um, you just don't even know. Um, I actually um, completely just um, separated myself from one of my, like, my old best friend. Um, not because, well, I don't know. See, they were nice in the beginning, but then they got changed just by hanging around the wrong crowd. Um, but because I was hanging around them, I was starting to become a little bit more like them, and I was starting to have their attitude. And uh, um, in order to stop that, then I needed to go ahead and just end it right there and not just not talk to them, hang out with them, or anything like that. Like, it's it's something gradual where you uh, you say oh you know that's not gonna um, mess with me but then um, when it starts to then you don't even know it and uh, it's just so gradual and slow that while it's happening to you and you're changing you just um, can't even tell that it is um, which is why it's so uh, um, dangerous not like dangerous, it's dangerous in that way that you would know. You know what I mean, right? Um, son. Um, so that's one thing. Friends, you really have to just, um, because I know that everybody has that friend that they know is really starting, that really, um, just isn't the best of friends, friends, and, uh, you know, you just gotta sort of step up and do what you really should do. Um, let's see, yeah. What you watch, um, let's say, I know that most people on YouTube cuss all the time and stuff like that, but, um, for anybody who doesn't, um, let's say that you watch something with a bunch of cussing or whatever, a bunch of, just everything, you know? That's not going to make you want to, want to not do it, it's just gonna make it more casual. Once you have something in your brain, um, your brain just starts to get used to it, 
and that's the way it just starts to think. You can't control that it does that, um, but you can control what your brain um, starts to change to. So basically, what you are influenced by is what sort of shapes yourself. It forms you. Um, let's see. There are lots of uh, smaller things, like um, just people that you talk to throughout the day. Um, if you're if you're hanging around a negative, somebody who's negative, you will start to become more negative. There is no way around it, unless you are plenty strong enough to just whatever get past that. But still, you it just can bring you down sometimes. When you're hanging around someone who's really positive and everything like that, you like them. It's all happy. Then you know that should be a good thing for you. Um, so basically, in conclusion, um, I didn't go over a whole lot, but still, um, there's just everything that just, um, just shows who, to just make who you are, and you should, you need to be careful, look through all that stuff what you are letting yourself um, to, um, I got it, I got it, it's exposed, what you are exposing yourself to. Even though it might not seem that good, you could end up losing friends and anything like that, because I know some people who have. Be careful. So that's all I've got for today, and I will see you next time. Um, oh, and I'll show some clips of my pets that, uh, oh, well, I said before, you already saw those. So, uh, yeah. Later, kids.